Yeah, hello everyone. Uh, you know, I just reflect um, back to, you know, why I got involved in On Passive. Uh, and I think all of us can do the same, you know, uh, and uh, as we look to see that we got in because some of us had dreams, uh, some of us had, you know, various goals, aspirations, you know, all of that. And the question is, you know, are those still alive, right? Are we still going to accomplish those things? And for me, it's a resounding yes, absolutely. There's no doubt whatsoever that that is the case. And that's all that matters to me, right? At the end of the day, will I be able to accomplish my goals that I came into on passive for, right? Are the right people involved in on passive to make that happen? And I remember listening to, uh, you know, those two audio tapes uh, from our CEO, Mr. Ash Mafara, and that's all I needed, right? And, you know, as time went on, you know, we saw so much and we, we, you know, got to know him a lot better and to understand the type of person that he is. And here is someone that has gone in the line of fire to say that we're going to do this or die. We're going to make this happen. We're going to uplift humanity. We are going to make sure that people uh, can actually dream again and not just dream again, but actually accomplish those dreams. Right. We look around us in society right now and we see chaos, whether it's in the U.S., whether it's in you know, Africa, Europe. It doesn't matter where you look in the world. All we see is chaos. We see the economy uh, falling apart. We see people struggling financially. Right. And we say, where is the solution? Can we turn to our government for help? The answer is no. Right? <laughs> can we can we turn to, um, you know, the banks for help? And the answer is no. Right. Your employer. Can you go to your employer and says, listen, I'm in a financial rut. Can you help me out here? Right. People are working two jobs, three jobs. Right. People are going online looking for ways out. Right. And they're meeting so many obstacles because not everyone is sincere about helping you. And the reality is most of us, if not all of us, actually need some sort of help. And where do I find that help? Where do I find that hope? I find that in on passive because it's the only company that I see that is willing to do what it takes to make sure that not just the company is helped, but that everyone who choose to come in, everyone who choose to be a part of this great company, right, actually have a real chance, a realistic chance of making their dreams come true. And that's what this is about. So for me, I will forever be with on passive. I will forever, you know, lock arms with our CEO because he's a man of integrity. This is someone that means you good, right? He's not here to hurt you. We're not here to hurt you. This company's not here to hurt you. That's not what on passive is about. And if we look at what has transpired from day one, from when you got in until now, you can see that for yourself. No one has to remind you about it. You can take a look and see exactly what your participation has been and where you are right now, right? And to see, okay, does it make sense that my dream is still alive? Can I go somewhere else and accomplish my dream? Is that possible, right? What are my choices? What are my options, right? And all I see is on passive. Why? Because it's a company still built with heart. No matter how you dice it, slice it, that's exactly what we see. And that's exactly what is happening here. So yes, company has to, you know, sort out whatever challenges, issues, you know, get the migration taken care of. Uh, whatever restructure that needs to be uh, in place, whatever it takes to make sure that we will be all right. And that's the bottom line, folks. So I'm sure there's many of you out there, hundreds of thousands of you out there that feel the same way like I do in that, yes, this is where I lay my hat. But this is where I can sleep good at night because I know that there's a man that's in charge that is willing to do what it takes. A man that's in charge that's willing to do it or die. Folks, you can't find that anywhere else. Your president, your prime minister, they're not going to do that for you. Your employer is not going to do that for you. You got family members that will not do that for you. But here's a man who's a stranger to most of us, and yet he's willing to do that for you. So that's why I stand with them and I lock arms with them because together, together, we're going to make your dreams, my dreams, all of our dreams a reality. Fantastic. 